Hi, I'm Dardola Chahi. I'm a stroke neurologist at the Ottawa Hospital and a senior scientist at the Ottawa Hospital Research Institute. A large part of my job is treating strokes acutely in the emergency department. And most strokes, when people think of a stroke, is the clotting variety called ischemic strokes. But one out of every four, one out of every five strokes is what we call intracerebral hemorrhage, or commonly known as the bleeding stroke, where a blood vessel bursts and people bleed into their brains. That's actually the most devastating form of stroke. It's the one that leaves a large proportion of people permanently disabled, uh, and unfortunately a good 40-50% don't survive the first three months. We're doing a very innovative, groundbreaking clinical trial here at the Ottawa Hospital called the FASTEST trial. This uses a compound called Factor 7, which is natural in your blood. It's a clotting uh, protein that we all have, but it's concentrated. And what we do is we administer it to a person having cerebral hemorrhage, uh, and the idea is that it stops the bleeding. So when a patient arrives in the emergency department with a cerebral hemorrhage, that'll be about one in four, one in five strokes, we'll be waiting for them at the scanner and preparing this medication right here. So our hope is once this trial is done and it shows that this medication can stop the bleeding, minimize injury, that we'll have a new treatment for cerebral hemorrhage. Patients would come to any hospital anywhere in Canada or the world for that matter and when they're determined to have bleeding in the brain, they'll be given this medication. It'll become the new standard and what we want to see is exactly what we saw with all the other strokes, a proper way to treat this and get patients back to their lives, back home, doing what they were doing before, restoring the independence. It would be a revolution in this field, a new way of treating this disease.